Okay, the passage suggests that anyone attempting to evaluate Mendelssohn's career must confront which of the following dichotomies. And I think that's really the key word here is what's a dichotomy? And so a dichotomy is a split between two things. And here the split is between his enduring popularity and his critical standing. And it says here, Mendelssohn's enduring popularity has often been at odds, sometimes quite sharply. And that's what we mean by a split or a dichotomy. You have Mendelssohn's reputation, and it's split between those who love him in a popular, popular crowd loves him, but the critics don't necessarily love him so much. So what, which of the following answer choices addresses this? So if we start with A, it says the tension between Mendelssohn's career as a composer and his career as a pianist and conductor definitely does not address the dichotomy between his popularity, his enduring popularity in general, with his critical standing. Let's look at B, the contrast between Mendelssohn's popularity. Okay, so I like where it's going so far, but then, ooh, he mentions Schumann and, Schumann and Brahms, and that definitely isn't where we're going. See the discrepancy okay, between Mendelssohn's popularity, there we go, his enduring popularity, and his standing among critics, and that equals his critical standing. So that's pretty much on the money right there. D, the inconsistency between Mendelssohn's reputation during his lifetime and after death, blah, blah, blah. None of that is referring to what we're going for. And then finally, E, the gap between Mendelssohn's prodigious, which means vast and immense musical beginnings, and his decline in blah, blah, blah. Why? Because that's just veering off topic. Never mentioned it. And C is right on the money.